Is there a relationship between neck pain and migraine? Yes, there is. That's a very interesting story, the, the neck pain story. So uh, it seems to be two directional. So we know that neck pain can be part of any part of a migraine episode. Often if people get neck pain as part of the prodrome, they can attribute the migraine as having been caused by the neck pain. So people will sometimes think that they're getting a, a cervicogenic headache. So their headaches are caused by having a stiff sore neck. Whereas in actual fact, the neck pain is the migraine starting. And we wonder if some of the, the reports we get of people going to get a massage and the massage really setting a migraine off to potentially be neck pain start of migraine, they get a massage, get a migraine that was coming anyway. That said, if you do have a neck problem, so a neck that is sore in between migraine episodes, we know that all of the pain wiring of your head and neck passes through the same trigeminovascular neurons in your brain stem. So any pain input to that area, be it a toothache, neck pain, uh, head pain from, from some other cause, bruxism, that's all going to lower your threshold of being tripped into a migraine attack.